Frogmen search for the bodies of three people killed when a helicopter crashed near the side of Melton Weir, 24 miles from Melbourne. A helicopter hit a power line and dived 50 feet below the surface. A mobile crane hoists the damaged copter from the weir. Flight engineer Keith Harvey was the only survivor of the crash, being thrown out of the aircraft before it hit the water. Rescued by speedboats within two minutes, he suffered only a broken arm. The captain and another man were killed. So was 23-year-old Melbourne TV personality Helen Woods. The helicopter was to tow a water skier in an aquatic carnival. But while making a trial run over the course, the tail rotor fouled a power line and the copter spiralled nose first into the weir. A flight to aid a charity carnival ends in stark tragedy. Australian and New Zealand crews get their 18-footers ready for the final heat of the World Championship on the Waitomata. It's an even start with conditions ideal, and Queensland champion Taipan leading ace high and Vindicator both from Auckland. Here comes Surprise, so far ahead on points that she can't lose the world title. There's Australian champion Jensen Girl. She's sailing well today, but Surprise has piled up too many points. Vindicator finishes third in the final heat, but at this stage, Quandary is ahead of her. Heffernan has sailed Jansen Girl to a lead of another minute over the New Zealand champion. Surprise takes the world 18-footer championship, but today she's no match for Jansen Girl. The Australian star wins the fifth heat by almost a minute, and a win by Jansen Girl is no surprise.